Hi, I'm Stefan Algat, Senior Climate Advisor here at the World Bank Group. And today I want to share another set of key data that is underpinning the crucial conversations taking place at Glasgow at the COP26. Let's dive into what can be a very confusing discussion. The link between global warming and climate extremes, such as heat waves, heavy precipitation, storms, droughts, tropical cyclones. Let's focus on heat waves. So heat waves are long periods of time during which the temperature remains higher than a certain threshold. And those events have a huge impact on health, uh, especially for the very young and the elderly. Okay, so now on this figure, you see one dot for every year over a 50 year period between 1850 and uh, 1900. In how many of those years did we experience a heat wave? Just one. But since then, the Earth has warmed by one degree Celsius. So how often do you think the same intensity of heat wave occurred today? Well, it's already five times more frequent. So over 50 years, you'll see five years instead of one with such an event. Can we say something about the future? Yes. Let's first look at a scenario where the temperature increased by 1.5 degree. This is one of the objectives of the Paris Agreement. So out of the 50 dots, we have now about nine dots with a heat wave. It means that the frequency of those events has been increased nine times. And if we can't make it and reach the 1.5 degree target and we go to two degree instead, well, the number grows to 14. So the, the frequency is increased 14 times. And if we imagine a scenario with no climate action at all, then the temperature could gets to up to four degrees Celsius. And in that point, it's most of the years, about 40 years out of 50, where we would have what was exceptional in the past with only once in 50 years. That acceleration and the impact on the, on the lives of millions of vulnerable people is why the decisions that will be made at the COP26 matter so much for everybody on this planet. Thank you very much and do look at the other data presentations in this special series.